Well, here we are, 21 days into my little experiment of a video a day for 2018. And um, not that I'm um, surprised at myself for keeping it going for this long, because I, I said that I would do. And I, I knew that there was going to be very little response uh, to the earlier videos, maybe even the whole way through. Maybe there'll be nothing at all for the whole 365 days. But it's um, it's all about keeping or building the habit, rather. And um, 21 days is a significant number for habit building, or, or supposedly it is anyway. And I'm sure most of you watching will have heard the the rule of thumb that it takes 21 days of doing something before it becomes habitual. And I can guarantee that that's not always the case. Maybe for some things it is, but that's more of a coincidence than any sort of uh, generic rule of thumb. And the reason being that to create a habit, to, cr to, to turn something from a thing that you have to really think about and consciously do into something that just becomes a part of your your day to day, uh, you need a couple of other elements. And there's a really nice acronym for this, which is AIR, um, A-I-R. So the, the habit itself and the repetition is the R. So doing the thing for 21 days or more or less, in fact, uh, is just one third of the, the what's required to to move this from the front forward thinking creative human part of your brain into the what's called the basal ganglia which is the 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 automatic part of the brain right there at the back of the skull which is um which takes care of the things that don't take any energy don't really take any conscious um energy hungry thought to to carry out like getting up in the morning you get dressed you do your teeth you go to work or whatever. And these are just things that we do without having to really make ourselves do it. It just, ha it just happens. So it just takes some physical effort, but it doesn't make, take much decision power to, to make that happen. So the other two elements, the A and the I, are attention and intention. So we have to really think about what it is that we're doing when we are carrying out the, the new habit, the new behavior. And we have to tie it into something that's important. So to, to, to mindfully do the thing, and also to remind ourselves as to why it is that we're doing it. That's the intention. What's the purpose of doing the thing that I'm doing? So the for me, it would be pretty difficult to do these videos <laughs> mindlessly. Um, but even then, just kind of, you know, I, I suppose it could be possible. I could I could shoot a video and just go through the motions of doing it. But actually, every time I'm doing, I'm thinking to myself, right, what, what I'm doing now is I'm doing two days video. And um, I'll be doing this every single day throughout 2018. So that's the attention. I'm placing attention on the process. The intention is that I'm doing this for a number of different reasons. Firstly, because I want to prove to myself that I can I can do it, and I want to document the process that I'm going through of this year of becoming a uh, professional speaker. And 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 actually, it's something that's important to me. Now I've said that I'm going to do it, and I, I'm fairly certain that I can. Uh, knowing that the process of doing a video a day is going to bring me all sorts of other benefits as well, other value. And the only way I can do that is if it is something that I stick to. So there are many reasons. There's there's a, a good number of intentions behind the process of doing it. So any time you're looking at setting a habit, you're setting a, uh, looking at creating a new behavior, just think about not just doing it for 21 straight days, thinking about what it is that you're doing, placing your attention on it, giving it some intention that's the why behind the what and thinking about how 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 often you do it for as well how long you do it for that'll be the repetition and if it's a behavior you're looking to create on an ongoing basis then the r is just something that needs to happen whether it's a daily basis twice daily perhaps um you know, for some for some habits some things you're trying to change behaviors you're trying to change uh, but looking at the repetition as just being one small part, it'll be an important one, but it's one small part of the process of transformational change. So there we go. That's my day 21 video, only another 344, don't think it's a leap year this year, 44 uh, to go, uh, enjoying the process so far. And I'll speak to you again tomorrow. Bye for now.